All right, so we got EA Sports 25 official ultimate team deep dive. Let's go to the video. Let's go. Let's go, man. Ultimate team in 25 is social. Uh, we got angry Ginge again. High face, bro. I haven't seen pipe face since like the 1940s. And loads more updates from community requests. Aslan, my guy, take her away. Young Philly. Oh, I know who Young Philly is. Well oh, hold on. Hey. EA is reaching in the back. Oh, wait a minute. Who is this? Wowzers. Hold on. Excuse me, miss. I seen you from across the room. Who? Whoa, 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 whoa. Who's? Bro, look how perfect her skin is. I... Okay. Um, But what I was, what I was going to say. Oh, yeah, bro. Bro, they got Young Philly. They got Pie Face. They got Angry Gens. Obviously, these are all, well... I know Young Philly. He's a um, he's a he's a content creator. Angry Jins. I think he's a he's a streamer. He might be a content creator too. I think he, he's a content creator. I mean, streamers are like content creators as well. Um, and I think Pyface. I think he's a content creator. I think he's a streamer. So, bro, EA they reach far in the back for this one. I like this. Our biggest update. To Smith. Is the addition of five oh, and she's good too. Wait a minute. Rush. Rush is a brand new five -side experience that will give you Wait, didn't we already check this out? And play with others. Whether you're by yourself or with friends, matches are always played with four people and an AI goalkeeper on each team. Bring in a oh. player from your club and you'll control them for the entire match. Wait, so is the AI? Okay. As you pick with the team bonuses, earning everyone rush points. Okay, so this is Rush and Ultimate Team. I like this. New Rush events will be released throughout the season that will allow you to use different players from your club and earn rewards. All right, here we go. It's the perfect complement to the intensity of rivals and champs. I like that celebration. Okay, that celebration was hard. Q is completely overhauling tactics in Ultimate Team, giving you more control over how your team behaves on and off the ball. Manager items will now feature tactical presets that make it easier than ever to emulate your favorite manager's tactical setup based on their real life style of play. Oh, is that? They got Sun. Okay, who, they, who else they got? Jude Bellingham. Uh, I'm better than him. Work rates have been replaced by roles, and special items released throughout the year can have boosted roles in different positions. Oh, okay. In FC25, Evos will be less restrictive, allowing you to use your favorite players more often. Hey, uh, bro, I'm going to have the best team ever. I'm going to be honest with you. This year, you can add backgrounds, borders, animations, and even sound effects to your players. Really? Okay. Heard your feedback. We're excited to finally introduce a storage system for untradeable player duplicates, which can be accessed from squad building challenges. About time. Also, we're moving contracts. Yeah. Oh my God. Thank you, Lord. Oh my God. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We've made improvements to rivals. I wish they removed contracts from NBA 2K, but okay, that's another story. Well, that's another story. That's another story. So even if you draw, you'll still progress. That's a whole another story, but it's fine. We're decreasing the total number of checkpoints and allowing players to be relegated when competing in the highest divisions. Live friendlies will no longer use your rival's rank for matchmaking and instead use form, ensuring that players will always want to compete at their skill level. Okay, those are, those, those are W's. New ultimate team stadium for you to personalize, paired with new broadcast elements that reflect your squad choices and highlight the most dangerous players on the pitch. Uh oh. We're excited about all these updates. Woo! Okay. Cosmetic Evos and some long awaited community. Oh, that was nice. That was nice. We'll see you on the pitch. Oh, you absolutely will. This sounds unbelievable. Can't wait to get started. Can't, w can't wait to get started. What will you do for the club? Man, I do a lot of things for the club. All right, but now listen. And all honestly, though, I like it, bro. First of all, removing contracts from like Ultimate Team slash like my team and stuff like that. I wish 2K can do the exact same thing, bro, because contracts are like the most annoying things I've ever had to endure whenever it comes to like Ultimate Team or like my team. Horrible. I'm glad that they actually removed that from the game. Uh, also, uh, what I do like is, bro, first of all, can we just first of all talk about, I'm going to be honest with you. Now, the first trailer that came through for this game, I wasn't a hater or nothing, but I was kind of just, like, fed up. You know, I was fed up because I'm like, you know what, man? I played this game 
ever since like FIFA 14, you know, and I, I've seen this game hit the uh, all, bro automatic highs, and I've seen the game like hit the automatic lows. And to be honest with you, I was kind of just like I was kind of just like tired. I was like, you know what, man? If the, if the game is good, is good. If it's not, it's not. I'm gonna I'm not I'm not gonna trip about it. I'm not gonna waste time on it. I'm not gonna waste a breath on it. It is what it is. And, you know, EA. I don't EA. I'm not like insulting you or nothing. I'm just saying, just like as a as a player of your game, bro. Um, I just got tired. I just got like, I wasn't really, I wasn't fighting for it anymore. Like, I, I wasn't fighting for this game being good anymore. I'm just, I have, I have to keep it honest with you. Um, and the fact is, you know, again, there's too many games out there that I play. Um, and to be honest with you, bro, like, like, what's the point? You know, uh, because there's a lot of companies out there that I'm not gonna mention, but there's a lot of companies out there, bro, that. They do. They make the same game over and over again, and then they wonder why less and less and less and less and less and less and less, and less people play their game. They and they wonder why they 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 they're, they're scratching their chin. They're 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 holding their heads up like these. They're they're putting their hands around their head and they're and they're they're grabbing their brain. They're trying everything in their might to to to, to just think. Okay, why are people leaving our game? Oh, no, you know why people are leaving your game. Because, and at the end of the day, I can't blame you. I, I, like, I can't sit here and blame you for, and, and, I'm, and again, I'm not talking to no company. You can try to use your imagination for a company that you might have in your head or whatever. But at the end of the day, bro, like, like you know why people are, are, you know why less people are playing your game every single year? Like, you know why. But at the end of the day, you are, like, it, it's like, you know, it could be like a sports game. It could be like an FPS game. It doesn't matter. It could be a game that you simply can't upgrade anymore. And that's the scary thing. Because when you have games like, for examples, okay, these are four examples. When you have games like 2K, when you have games like EA Sports uh, FC, when you have games like, I don't know, MLB, when you have games like, um, uh, um, 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 what else, Madden, when you have like, you know, like we have like these sports games, when you have games like Call of Duty, or something like that. Like you know what, Call of Duty doesn't count. I'm gonna remove Call of Duty from the, from that conversation. I'm just, I'm just talking about the sports right now. When you have a lot of these sports games, there's only so much you can do. Um, you don't want to, you know, it, it's not like Fortnite to where you can add anything in the game, uh, because in reality these are sports game, and it, and if you add if you add like an overwhelming element to the game, then at that point it wouldn't be the game. It would be it would be something completely different. At that point it would be it would it would legit be like a Fortnite, you know. Um, and you know, and bro, maybe you know. Listen, maybe some of these sports game needs something really strong and needs something really different to like really, uh, like confuse a lot of people. You know, to get something buzzing. Because at the end of the day, bro, I've been seeing the same games for years, man. And to be honest with you, and again, I'm not saying you know any company, or whatever. But um, but to be honest with you, bro, I, like I've seen it all, I've done it all, and um, I'm not mad. You know, if, if these companies can't think of any new ideas, bro. Um, you know, a lot of these sports games, you simply just can't, I mean, you can come up with new ideas. You can't come up with new modes. You can, uh, obviously upgrade the graphics every single year. Uh, but even that bro, like that's hard to do because when you max out on graphics, you know, I mean, and I understand that we got new technology that like we keep getting new technology and stuff like that. We, you know, we got AI and stuff like that. So, uh, you know, quality is going to be like crazy in like 2040, but to be honest with you, you know, there's only so much you can add. So to be honest with you, bro, I'm really impressed with uh, EF, uh, I said EF, uh, EA Sports FC 25 because uh, they added in like a new mode, a new rush mode. Uh, that sounds really, really, really interesting. It's like uh, it's like a very fast paced short uh, game. Um, it's kind of like it's kind of like a uh, like a resurgence or like a rebirth for like uh, FIFA. That, that sounds really cool, bro. Sounds really cool. Hopefully, you guys would have been missing. You guys subscribe to the channel, like the video. And uh, to be honest with you, bro, I'm really liking what I'm seeing so far. So, uh, EA, you guys definitely impressed me with this. Uh, hey, EA's been on the roll this year, bro. They got um, College Football 25, Madden, and they got, um, you know, the soccer game, or sorry, the, the football game, EA Sports FC 25 coming through. So, EA, you know, listen, EA, y'all been cooking this year. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, see you guys. I'm out. And.